gonna build a skate park on a barge, gonna go to different ports and dock for a day. Granite with colored concrete, steel rails, quarter pipes, banks to walls. We got all kinds of crazy stuff going on. New York being such a strong street skate environment, it's really natural and raw, and this is gonna be really cool to give them a perfect skate park to skate on. You know, I don't think no other companies are out doing stuff like this for Go Skate Day, and it's just like, it's, it's dope for the community. And we were working with about 20 different designers to try and replicate a lot of the stuff that's not skatable in New York anymore. I like the Brooklyn Bank remake. It's a lot easier to skate than the original Brooklyn Banks, that's for sure. They had a little bump of flat over there, a little rail over here. When I started skating, I would see videos with those pyramid ledges and the dream of the day I could finally come skate and by the time I ever made it here, they were knobbed and I could never skate. You can't go skate in front of City Hall, you can't go to the grocery store and skate. There's no skateboarding signs everywhere, but we need to give them positive places to go to. Sometimes you spend days just looking for a place to skate. You don't even get to actually skate that day. You keep getting kicked out or chased out or whatever the case is. For them to have access to a place to skate, you can just see how they're growing. Not only as like a skateboarder, but as a person. See so much kids get into drugs, violence, and it's just like, I have something to go to on my spare time that I could work on. Skateboarding is just it for me. People would never get a chance to ride on such an incredible skate park. It's inspirational to allow them to come out here. It's free of charge. It's, it's inclusive. And it's really a give back for Nike to the skate community.